Hi everybody, welcome back to the stream. I'm back with Fatal Frame 3, The Tormented. We saw some really cool hauntings last time. At least in the house. I was pleasantly surprised. They're really creepy. I'm really liking the ghosts in this game. Okay, I think we did everything we could in the apartment, so let's go to sleep. It's not an apartment, it's a house. <laughs> <clears throat> How's it going? Good morning to you. <laughs> Excited to get back to the spooky manor. Hi, Neko. How's it going? Glad to see you here. Oh, shit. That's Miku. I thought I wasn't going to have it anymore. Emulation does not like me gives voice. <laughs> we get to be Miko again? Oh cool. You thought you escaped from spookiness. You're wrong. Okay. Does she have a camera? Yes. Is this the... Oh my god, is this the one from the first game? Oh my goodness, I think it is! I remember that big hole in the... Oh, we're back! <laughs> she can never escape. Maybe she can say hey to her bro. <laughs> oh, I don't need to say no. Let's do a quick save just in case I have to fight something. I don't want to have to reload this. Cool. Uh, I guess she has ongoing nightmares about this place. Oh, they do? Oh, hey, look, it's your camera. I thought I already had that equipped. Okay. Well, uh... Oh, this looks locked. Okay, let's go over here. Nope. I really didn't think we'd get to play her. This is kind of cool. <laughs> yeah. They're too busy kissing and stuff in that uh, underground section. Alright. I mean, does Miku have survivor skills? I mean, she did try to save her brother and he chose to stay. Yeah, I like it too. It's always fun to revisit. I think one of the coolest things in Silent Hill 3 was seeing some of the Silent Hill 1 environments recreated, like the Midwitch classroom, Alessa's uh, hospital room, and her bedroom. It was so cool. All right. Um. Mm -mm. Okay, so I gotta move stuff, but I'm not quite sure. Minute script. 
Oh, can I not open it now? Okay. Wait, I'm sorry. What? She has a kid with her brother? What? No. Oh, okay, that's why you said queen of incest. I was like, maybe I'm missing something. Was this before going to the manor? A what? What? <laughs> Miku! Ew! That's gross! What is wrong with you? Okay. Uh... Wait, is it her... Okay, it only makes it slightly better. Are they related by blood or not? They're not related by blood. It's a little less icky. Oh, oh God. Why? 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 Oh, my goodness. Oh, shit. Axe the guy. Shit, shit, shit. Mr. Axe, dude. Oh, wrong way. Controller shaking like a mofo. Mm, there we go. So, okay. I'm, I'm reading the chat. Okay, so <laughs> it's something made up later in the series. They're blood related. It happens when he's dead. Would she have a ghost baby? Oh my, couldn't they just have like a unseen other sibling or something <laughs> you could play as? Um, okay. Ooh, that is, that is something I didn't expect the series to go. Okay. So this isn't the Oculus. Oh, why does it call it an Oculus? Um, camera obscura. Is this a normal? Oh, it's a normal camera. All right. Let's try this again. I assumed it was willing because she was worried about her brother. <sighs> yeah, why couldn't they just have hooked up? That would have been better. Or, wait, oops, I'm going the wrong way. Okay. God, now I'm grossed out. <laughs> 
<laughs> me kill. Let's try this again, but this time actually get some zero shots instead of failing every other. These doors weren't closed. Zero. Still messed it up. Wait a second. Am I using crappy film? Is that why I'm not getting any points? I'm using four. I guess I just missed it. into him. What? No! Oh, man. Get it together, Brittany. You can do this. Oh, shit. Do it. Okay, there's four main bloodlines. Yeah. And part of Five's plot is Miko has gone missing. Her daughter has to go search for her. The fact that they included canon lore in it was even worse. <laughs> yeah. Okay, I should do a quick save here. Alrighty. Let's go. Come on, Miku. We gotta get some zero shots in.
Oh, you know what? I think it's because her little, uh, I wasn't getting points because the whole yellow ring didn't, didn't get filled up before. You can do it. Oh, wrong way. Wrong way. I'm just saving it every time I get a good shot. <laughs> took way too long. <laughs> okay, I guess I'm gonna have to put that... Oh! Special ability, Sacred Stone. Alright. Slow a ghost's movements by pressing the O button. So I think that's the B button from the Xbox, and using the Sacred Stone, you can slow the movement of ghosts. Okay. Alright. Let's, uh, upgrade her camera. So, what do you guys think, Jet, here? Alrighty. A uh, Yomoko or Shadowborn is an entity or a child born between a dead man and a living woman. I thought that was the Antichrist, at least according to American Horror Story. <laughs> People who are born from this union are said to be half dead from birth and have extraordinary strong sixth senses, making them feared and sometimes highly respected by people around them. Giving birth to one significantly decreases the lifespan of the mother. How to receive uh, involves a strong emotional attachment and longing for a deceased loved one. Oh my goodness. Okay. So let's Oh, I don't even have enough for it yet. Alrighty. Gotta make some more points. So do I use it over here? No. Okay. Maybe we put the mask on where the other mask was? Hurt by the rope? What? Wow, Miku. <laughs> You're a veteran. You should you should be a little bit um, cooler than you are right now. Let's uh, go ahead and save my game. I mean, of all the things, that's what like. <laughs> 
a rope. Oh. <clears throat> you just dealt with a hatchet-wielding ghost. Is this right here? Wait a minute. Well, this is different. Okay. So, dream version of this manor is a little bit... have some warping going on. Look at me. Get a picture of a ghost. Like last time? No? Oh! tonight. Okay. Mm -mm -mm. Mm -mm -mm. Let me reload my game. Uh, I think she was in the first game. Because I remember fighting a ghost like her before. Let me heal her up. Maybe I won't die right away. And, uh... Oh, there's an item. I can't believe they did my girl dirty like that, making her injure her brother. Longing for him. Oof. Didn't she just have a nice life with a normal boyfriend? Husband?
I thought the the first one, the the one I got, the was the good ending. Where he stayed behind. Oh shit, not this again. Okay. So six moves. Yay! Well, there's an ending where Koyu survives and leaves with Miku. Oh yeah, I forgot about that. Uh, so, you suspect of our section of the game actually uses the same model from uh, Fatal Frame 1. Oh! That's pretty cool! Oh yeah, oh, it's snowing over here.
Looks like a diary or something, but the moisture coming in through the window has smudged the writing and I can't read any of it. Crimson Diary. Snow is falling. It's a quiet night. This could be the last snow of the ten years of changing seasons I have watched from this window. As I watch the snow, I get the feeling that something has passed. Finally, I have severed all of my attachments. I'll give my body over to the ropes and seal the gates. Now she's gonna check the body. <laughs> yeah, it's very similar to the Alex Shepard thing. No attachments. No attachments to this world. Yourself. This is the third ghost you've seen. That's actually really creepy. With the lin limbs part way off like that. So can she not do combo shots? It hasn't appeared. Is that what's her fit raise um ability? Maybe I just have them getting uh proper fatal frames. Man, I fucked that up. <gasps> oh no! That is we don't want her to die that way. <laughs> oh, so much. Jesus Christ, that was doing terribly. <laughs> okay. Come on. We can do it. We can do it. We just need to not fuck up too much. Come on, 
that scary lady, let me take a picture. Let's start over. Oh, I'm back here. I saved it earlier. Later, excuse me. I can't speak tonight. I think it's probably the, the one of the diary we just found. I didn't realize it was a, <clears throat> a different girl the first time I read it. I hit the button too fast and missed the name! Oh, it's just, I should save it. Oh, this seems to be a good spot to be in. Yeah, we did it. Oh, I bet that door's open now. Yep, just like the good old days, using all my health items. <laughs> Is there anything else in this room? Wait, which door did I go through? Oh. Okay. Mm. I feel you. Don't you want to see him? Don't you want to see your your bro and his new girlfriend? I feel okay. you. I feel you. Okay. So I bet that unlocked that that sealed door into the entrance. I bet she, she got jealous. Like, if you're gonna have a ghost kid, you're gonna have a ghost kid with me. How dare you? <laughs> My mind went there too. <laughs> Ooh, 
what is with games doing shit like that? Like, it was it was like when I went and I read the uh, fan wikia for for Clock Tower, uh, and I learned that was her name Kay was some sort of pedophile, and that's why she was with the evil scissor kid dude. And I was like, I really did need to know that. Wait, isn't this the door I have to get through? Oh. Big brother's over here. <gasps> Big brother's over here. I don't want to see him. And then, of course, I mean, the game was already kind of creepy enough uh, with the reporter dude in his 30s trying to date Jennifer, who was 16, I think. And then the other dude who was obsessed with Jennifer, who was the assistant to the doctor, he was in his 30s. Those screws. Nolan. Yeah. Did you get scared by rope? Nope. You learn. Oops. Big brother's over here. Over here. I messed up. Oh! Let's reload that. Alright. I can totally do it this time. And they made it seem like a good thing that when she got with that reporter guy, and I was like, oh, ew, yeah. he's. So old for her. Hell yeah, we got points. Yeah, we're talking about a clock tower too. that through line about Kay, I think her name was, being a pedophile or whatever, was something that was only really in the supplementary materials. I think the novelization went into it. So it wasn't something super overt, overt in the game or anything like that. Oh, we're in the, um, the other manor now. You can get some research done, uh, me while you're here. Uh, find out about those shadow guys. For me? Thanks. Did I call her here? Uh, Miku. My controller shaking, is there... Oh, it's red. That means I'm gonna have to fight something. Just hold it here, is it gonna do it? Okay, 
Do I have to step close closer? I want to hold the blue for me. I am just wasting film now. Reload. Let's switch to the crappy film. What are you hacking uh, it for? Anything in particular trying to find? Just uh, cool... Cool things. How am I supposed to get this? It only lights up for a second. Can we get closer? There we go. Okay. See how many characters. Oh, all right. See if there's any health items up here. Are um, Nintendo really kind of like mean about taking down those types of videos? Items. Well, it's the same thing Ray said. How'd you make enemies at Capcom? What, uh, which game did you hack? Did they actually contact you to say, hey, take them down? Or did you get strikes on your channel?
How do we get into this space? Huh. Do we go up from above? Oh, damn. I'm so sorry. I didn't realize they get really they get really mad about that. <clears throat> and the next page is a picture showing that as being swallowed up by a snake. Maybe this is a book illustrating local myths or folk tales or something. You should get that book for uh, Ray. She currently has a tattoo appearing on her body. Too heavy. Probably only a man can move it. What's with you and Ray? You just put a little elbow grease. I'm sure you could do it. Does this mean I'm going to be play, playing a dude because I keep referencing only a man can do stuff? <sighs> oh, okay. He shows up. <laughs> Peeling, surrendering of the flesh, shrine eating. Okay, so I guess you can't go further. You know, you could just climb over the bookshelf. It's pretty low. You could do that. Okay. I'm not quite sure where the game wants me to go now. So that ladder must lead down into uh, this area. I can't seem to push my way through. <clears throat> drapes are made of cement or something. Alright, where am I supposed to go? Uh... Okay, can't go that way. Does the game want me to go back? This way, then? Seems like... Oh. Oh, wait, duh, Whitney. There's a door right here. <laughs> yeah, wall hack would be really cool go down into the secret um, club room. Save the two. Save the two? Is that what she said? <gasps> Wait, were you, were we Ray playing as Miku? Oh, I guess so. Was that Miku stream? But why? You guys should have a little chat. Be like, hey, you know, we're having some weird L dreams here. Is Miku getting a tattoo too? Do, 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 anything creepy? I don't see anything creepy. You up? Hey, I just had your dream. Miku? Ray, I'm sorry. I, I don't feel so well. I couldn't sleep. Let me turn this up a little bit. Ooh. 
Oh, Ray, I don't feel so well today. I didn't sleep so well. Miku, did something happen yesterday? I just had a strange dream. That's all. Please, don't worry about me. By the way, a letter came for you this morning. I left it in the kitchen. Thanks. Get some rest today. And then there's this. Oh, look at Kay. He's, he's, he's a cutie. Uh, Kay Amakura, isn't this him? Where did you find this photo? Yesterday, looking through my brother's albums. My brother worked on the same editing team as you for a while. I thought there might be a photo of him left over from those days. I see. Thank you. On the back of the photo is written, K. Amakura, recent photo of author. Cool. Is that all I can do with her? I guess so. So you said her doll's hair grows longer? Okay, it's like a little bit over her shoulders now. Okay, I'll keep an eye on I'll make sure to check it. Alright, let's head downstairs. Oh wait, we should probably check uh, Yu's room. See if there's anything creepy. Okay, it doesn't look like... Oh! In the bookcase, there's a book with a projector similar to the one you photographed in the mansion. Cool. Good thing I checked. The spirit world. The device shown here was left by... Kunihiko Azu. He used it to substantiate the existence of and communication with the spirit world. He was a brilliant scientist and philosopher, and by appropriating Western culture in the late 19th and early 20th centuries, he combined new technology with his theory on the spirit world to prove its existence. It is said that few of his devices were able to capture an unbelievable existence from the spirit world, but posthumously from that singular beginning, his devices became a fashion item among dilettantes, dilettantes and were scattered about the country. Okay. One such device is this projector. Having completed the experimental stage of the camera obscura, a camera that photographs the other world, see above, he created a screen upon which to project the special images captured on film on the film. The records say that images were projected that could not be seen when they were photographed. Okay, was there any other books? Okay. Nothing else? E I think so? Seems like he he'd be older. He looked pretty young in that photo, though. Like, I was picturing a dude in his 40s. Not not someone in their 20s. At least he looked like he was in his 20s. Ooh, I wonder if the feet are going to be down there. Aw, no feet. What was that? Did I miss something? I wasn't looking. She just all of a sudden stopped. 
and I thought my controller shut off. <laughs> I was looking at the screen. <laughs> oh, letter. Oh, I didn't want to read this yet. Okay. <sighs> Dare you. Have you listened to the three tapes I sent before? Three? I only had one. I sent before. I'd like you to listen to them before you read the rest. Maybe you won't believe it, but I've had the manner of sleep dream. First, I thought I was just thinking about the manner too much, but after listening to those tapes and to Mio, I'm displaying the same symptoms. In the dream, I'm in a snowy manner. I don't remember it well, but it resembles the house I got the camera obscura from. I get a bad sense from the manor, just like the testimonies. The only difference is I was pursuing Mio in the manor, and Mio wasn't dead. If the urban legend of the manor of sleep is true, and I can wake Mio from her dream, maybe I can save her. Even if it makes little sense, I feel I'm getting closer to the truth. Regards. Three cassettes, maybe they are in Yu's room somewhere. No feet. Okay. Let's see. I want to say hi to the cat, but I guess it won't let me. Oh, really? Okay. I'll have to keep, uh, keep checking till I see the feet in the shower. creepy yet. Oh, no problem. Alright, let's head back upstairs and talk to Miku and then um, see if I can find those tapes. Oops. In Yu's room. I'm really excited, excited to see all the little hauntings. Oh, maybe. Maybe I'll have to check again. Unless it forces me into the dream world by listening to them. Let's talk to Miku first. Oh, you're right! I forgot! I did listen to the tape and then I saw the feet. Hey! Having trouble sleeping? Do you need to sleep in here with me? That's not like that's not like part of the game, is it? With her voice kind of cutting out like that. That must be an emulation thing, or is it trying to show me she's possessed? Because it's just hey, her. This is it. Ray, about that photo of the doll on the skewer. I wasn't able to find anything on it. No surprise there. I thought. It may be similar to the legends of the straw dolls passed on in Tono. Anyway, it has something to do with folklore, so you might find something in one of you's books. 
Thanks. I'll go take a look. You can ask me whatever you want, okay? Oh, you blinked. Thank God you're alive. Okay. It seems like you're having a lot of nightmares lately. Are you alright? No. It's raining again. Oh, whoa. Is that new? Oh, I guess not. Okay. <laughs> no bonus this quarter for you, Missy. Oh, use room. Oh, it wasn't? Oh. I just assumed it was something with my emulation. I mean, I did, I, I ripped the, I made an ISO from the PS2 game I bought. But, sometimes things are still funky. Okay, uh, let's check. It's desk? In the desk drawer, there's a thick envelope. It is from K. Amakura. Perhaps it's the cassette tape from the letter. Probably. Okay. Dear you, I got the tape on the manner of sleep, urban legend, from a source at the hospital. A psychiatrist had recorded the me medical condition of a patient. There's a lot of background noise as it was originally recorded on a gramophone, but the content is great. It's not quite anthropology, but I think you'll be interested, too. It's a lot to ask, but I'd like you to find out about legends or cases of missing people similar to this one. Regards, K. Amakura. Uh, okay, that's one. Oh, there's another one. Okay. See, is there something? Okay, so there's a photograph with scenery closely resembling the scenery in the other photograph. Skewered dolls. In many regions, particularly in the mountain areas, there remains a folk practice of dressing up dolls they make from straw, earth, or cloth and worshipping them as idols. The doll in the picture was reported by an await resident. It's called Kashumi, and when someone dies in the village, they weave the hair of the deceased into the straw and have it wear his or her kimono. The doll is fixed onto skewers and put before a shrine at the edge of the mountain. So it's kind of like a, a scarecrow for the dead. Since they use straw and stuff. <clears throat> the doll is enshrined for up to one month after the death, and then after that period passes, passes, it is cast into the river behind the shrine together with various offerings. In this region's tradition, there is said to be a cave in the mountain connecting to the land of the gods. The dead who became Kashumi... It... Wait, is that the name of the... Is that what that guy turned into in the second game? No, that was another K word, wasn't it? Okay. Kashumi stand between the village and the mountain. They take upon the village's evil and head to the land of the gods. In a neighboring village, there is said to be a similar doll called Igushi, but this one is the spirit of a person who died young and is deified in the mountains. Okay. Uh, in one interpretation, both village and mountain have a protective deity standing in the border between people and gods. Uh, in another sense, burdening the dead with evil or deifying the spirit of the young in, the, in a mountain connotes human sacrifice. Okay. Is there any other books? Okay. Um, yeah, I'm really 
surprised she hasn't given him a call. I'm sure you has a phone book. She could probably look up his number and be like, hey dude, you keep sending me shit. You is dead. But you know, I'm kind of in a pickle right now if you want to help out. <laughs> uh, okay, yeah, this is a different word. Oh, by the way, I do have Kuan. Uh, a friend passed me an ISO so I could totally play the very expensive game I will never own. Uh, notes, right? Alright. Incidents. Snake bruise. Okay, every time I dream of the house, the snake-like tattoo gets bigger. The stabbing pain is worse every day. If things carry on like this, it will eventually cover my whole body, and then... The dreams, the manner, what do they mean? How can I escape? Niku was singing the same lullaby I heard inside the manor. She says she heard the song in her dream, too. Has she been having the same dreams? Is she being lured into the house, too? Just like Yoshino and Takigawa and me? Maybe you guys should talk to each other about the weird shit you're seeing in your dreams. I mean, I don't know if that would really stop it if it's already in motion, but be more prepared exchange notes on the shit you see in there. Okay, uh, human columns. The mound of graves in the courtyard inside the manor. In the ruins of an old castle, the bones of the people thought to have worked on the construction were found under a mound. Shrine carpenters were buried alive as sacrifices. Did the same thing happen there too? Probably, given how icky it is. Oh. Oh yeah, I think um the poll I think Kuan won. So I think I'll be doing that one next. I also have the indie game I won in a Twitter giveaway. The uh, Silent Hill was supposed to be an inspiration. So there's that one too. I forgot to put that on the poll. But I think I'll do Kuan and then that indie game. Okay, but Miku tells me the house I went to is famous for being haunted. They say it's a place where people can meet the dead. Inside the house was a courtyard. It was snowing. There was a line of graves and even older house looming up behind. Sacred rope was hung along the narrow corridor behind the door where I heard... Oh. Oh, now we're on the... Sh okay. Screw it all. So what's new here? Inside the manor, in a courtyard surrounded by a corridor, is was a tree wrapped with sacred rope. Around it stood straw dolls, dolls skewered on stakes. In the small room where I heard the lullaby, red dolls were nailed to walls. To the walls. Inside was one of the girls dressed as shrine maidens who tried to impale me in my daydream. Her palace in the house and Miko's dream is different from the one I've been seeing. The quarters hung with a rope, the blood altar, the woman torn apart. Miku tells me the house I went to is famous for being haunted. Oh wait. Okay. People. Oh wow, I have a lot of new notes here. She wanders the house in her dreams looking for Foyu, her brother. And apparently a lover. <laughs> Wait, hold on. Okay. She's always been so cheerful and strong. What happened to her in the past? Is she still wounded by what happened, just like me? Okay. A friend of Yu's researching the manner of sleep. He and you were researching an urban legend about the manner of sleep. In the same manner I had been seeing in my dreams. He started looking into it because of his niece, Mio, who fell prisoner to her dreams about the manner of sleep. But he got sucked in too in the course of his research, and now he's trying to find a way to escape from the dreams. I think it's kind of cool that they're giving us background information because there's so many uh, names being thrown around. So if like you didn't play the earlier games, you might be super lost. <laughs> Alright. 
And here is her bro, written in Kei's letter, was the name of Miku's brother, Mfuyu. He was a friend of Kei and Yu, who disappeared while on the trail of the missing writer, Junsei. Uh, blah, blah, blah. We did that one already. I knew Miku had lost a relative, but I thought he had died. She never spoke about her brother. That photo. Is Miku still longing for the brother she lost? <laughs> oh, that just finding out about the ghost baby has now tainted everything. Begging for help. Well, I'd have to... The other games are... We right? So I could definitely hook my Wii back up to see if I can get the... I don't know if I could play the fourth one, but I could try to get five. Okay, the girl who called Miku back when she tried to leave her dream. Your brother's here, she said in a sad, mournful voice. Miku was stunned by what she heard. Yeah, because he, she thought he left with Kiri. Hey, right, mother and daughter. Anything new here? Okay, we already read that. Girl who pierced my daydream. Visited. Okay. I wish they'd mark what page is actually new because I've read some of this already. If the manner I saw that day was the one I dream about. The one I heard about from Miku, does that mean they are carrying out some kind of ceremony there? Impaling people. Probably. Hey, last person. Okay, after completing its camera obscura, capable of capturing images of the other world, he made a projector using the same technology. Using this, he was able to play back supernatural images recorded on film that could not be seen on conventional equipment. The old projector from the house I saw in my dream. Okay, that's a repeat. Alright, cool. I think I've caught up on all the notes now. Save it. Oh, oh, five is Wii U. I don't have a Wii U. Um, it's got an English patch. Oh, okay. Cool. Then I might be interested. I might have to look up to see if I can get uh, that dolphin emulator going. That might be easier to play than with the Wii mote. Okay, so let's, I guess, listen to the tapes and see if I can get any more hauntings. Okay, we did. We did A, right? So, B. Same dream one. Huh? I'm 
many times do I have to explain it? It was a manor. And it was snowing. There was blood. Lots of people that collapsed all over. In the hallway, in the room, everywhere. Yes, it was a man in white clothes. But he had no face. There was a hat no, and guy. blood <laughs> on the walls. I always ran as hard as I could. So far. Lots of hands came out of the walls. But when I came to, somehow I was the one chasing the man. That's right. It was painfully cold. Even when I woke up, I saw the one light by the face. <laughs> okay, so Hatchet Man. Alright, let's see it. <laughs> that sounded really weird out of context. <laughs> I bet it did. Okay, let's see if I can find some feet. Is it always feet? Or do they do other uh, little peepy -pee things? Let's see. Oh, Jesus, Miku scared the shit out of me. I wasn't expecting to see her. <laughs> I thought that was the ghost. <laughs> I got all excited, like, oh my god, it's full body apparition. No, it's uh, Miku. Let's see. Any feet in the kitchen? Nope. Bathroom. Wait, can I open this up yet? No. Ooh, is there going to be one where I knock and someone knocks back? That would be pretty cool. Hmm. I know, and there are elaborate tattoos too. I think they'd be grateful. That costs a lot of money, usually. Well, boo. No ghosts. So I guess we'll go back to the dream manor. When's Freddy gonna show up? Freddy, the Freddy uh, killer. There's also another character. I guess he was in the remake. You could play him as a survivor, and he looks really creepy and messed up. Like his face looks really wrong. <laughs> he doesn't look like the actor guy at all. Quentin, that's his name. I couldn't think of the name earlier. Alright, let's go ahead and save.
I not? Oh. Am, am I being K right now? Instructions for special action hide added to the file. All right. So he can't, he can't fight with the camera. Okay. By pushing the O button, you can crouch to hide. It turns blue. Okay. This is gonna be fun. So is this a button? Okay, this is crouch. So it's, this <clears throat> it's the same button as the camera. Oh, hell! It's what's her face? Uh. Um. I can't believe I just forgot her name. My. Uh. Mio? No, oh, it's Mio? I thought it was her sister. Mayu? Because she's saying, I'm sorry, blah, blah, blah. Oh, it's Mio. Okay. Alrighty. We gotta find the key for the butterfly. Where am I? Oh. It's where the ghost went, but let's, let's follow her. We're not going that way. <sighs> I know she could have just not killed her sister. I mean, they had a way out. They just had to go head back to the, the shrine and go out the back way. Purple Diary. How many days has it been? How many months? How many years? Many outsiders have been brought here, but none of them are like him. He said my hair was beautiful, but no matter how much I arrange it, I'll probably never know how I feel. All I can do is comb my hair and wait for him. That way, when he comes back with his camera, he'll take my picture again. What's with the hair? Among the fragments, a hairpin engraved with holly reflects the light. A black clump of something is stuck to the wall behind the mirror stand. It looks like hair. Okay. Oh, wait. Maybe I should go up. Okay, guess not. Uh, yeah, because he's he's chasing after Mio. And, uh, Kari said, although she could have just not killed her sister. <laughs> and I'm like, yeah, for some reason, she went through with it. When they had an out, they just had to make it back to the shrine.
Was she possessed by, um, uh, Sai? Yeah, okay. Where am I supposed to go? That's bond. An old pollen quin hangs from the roof beams. What is that? Okay, I don't know what that means. Or what it does. <laughs> Maybe this was the wrong way to go. No one's here. Wait, can I not move while I'm crouched? What kind of bullshit's that? Oh my god, this sucks. Can't see my flashlight. How do I? Okay, I'll slowly make my way back over here. Oh. I guess I didn't activate or leaving yet. Am I just waiting for her to leave the room? Or am I supposed to get to the door? Okay. Oh, the ghost's right there. <laughs> She'll never look back where she was. I really don't know what I'm supposed to do here. Am I supposed to get back to the other room, maybe? Fudge! Um. Oh, she lost me. Wow.
Maybe she's away from the stairs now. section. Ooh. Oh, let's go this way. No, I'm just going through a door. You don't see me. She's gone. Alright. Okay, let's go get the door open. Wait, that's the door I went through. Why did I think it was a smaller door? He can't use that.
Oh, wait, shit, he has a camera. Wait, why am I hiding from ghosts if I have a camera? Can I fight you? I guess not. Hmm. Guess I need to find my way over to the heavy bookshelf. I don't remember where that was. Let's try the other door. in this room.
Oh, I'm like in plain view. Oops. No, you didn't. No, you didn't. No, you didn't. Watch. At least he doesn't die like right away. I can still run away. Okay. Oh, I probably want to go the other door. You're here too. I finally found the place with the bookshelf. I think this is the thing with the bookshelf. Or maybe it's not. This wasn't the bookshelf thing. Folklore Notes 3. It's been nearly half a month since I entered this mansion. It's still snowing outside. Once the snow melts, I'll be parted from Kyo Kyoyuka and most likely never be able to return. Men are not needed in the manor if necessary. I could run away, but if I, if possible, I would like to take Kyoka with me. That feeling is what keeps me here. Sometimes worshippers from nearby villages come here. All of them cover their faces and head to the shrine. Today's worshippers seemed like a woman. She was holding a child-sized bundle and it looked like if she was sh looked as if she was crying. I can also hear that lullaby. I wonder if the ceremony is like some sort of funeral.
Yeah, it's just this one room. Let me see there. Okay, we gotta head down. Go back to the hair room. Okay, that was Is it no, that's the dining room. Where's the hair room? Is that the commode room? Okay, I need to go to the second floor. Okay, uh, how do I get to the second floor again? That's locked. Get up to this room, I think. The ghost is right there. Can I find her? Does she not even see me? Oh, she sees me. Let me see the ghost in here. Where's the ghost? Okay. Um. Oh. Hello, ghost. Take a picture of her. You think you would come back? Yay. 
thank you. Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. Run away. Oh, let's go through here. Okay, let's head back downstairs. Wrong way. Here's the one with the bookshelf. Here we go. Now we're a manly man. We can move it. <laughs> so stupid. just climbed over the bookcase. Didn't have to move it. Hopper up the Tome of Instruction written in the ink of the etching of the soul. Oh! Butterfly key. Yeah, I don't remember where that door was. So we have a film to watch now. Now that he pushes aside, does this mean uh, Ray and Miku can come through here? Hopefully. Ghost. Can I take a picture? Oh, there's a ghost I can take a picture of. Oh well. I messed it up. Oh shoot! She came back. Hey. Hey girl. What's up?
Let's go watch the film. The film room is over here, right? Here we go. Okay, so I need to... Okay. I forget where the door Miku ran in was. Is that over here? This door right here?
Closing that door. Was it one of these? I don't remember where the frickin' door is. Okay, another door. I'm gonna try every locked door until I find it. Yes, it is, especially when you don't remember where things are. All these places look so similar. Okay, so is it this one? No, so that's, that's the... I guess I'll head back to this side where these two doors are. Unless it's this door. Oh, no, that's not the door. This is the outside portion. Okay, so we'll head over to this hallway, I guess. Um, God. Oh, that's at the door. Well, at least I'm not constantly being chased by a ghost, so that's a plus. Still locked. <sighs> Should have taken note where the butterfly door was. Okay. Gotta go up. It's not up. Thank you for hanging out. I will be streaming tomorrow starting 8.30 Pacific time. Have a good night's sleep. Okay. Is it down over here? <laughs> I appreciate it. I stream to eleven, so maybe you can hang out when your when your stream is done. Okay, I'm in the film room. Ghost guy is following me. No, don't follow. It follows! The movie's true! What's it over here? Ooh. Maybe? Ooh! This kinda looks familiar. Wait a sec. I have not. I, I need to get that game, but it would totally be fun to, to stream that game. Uh, just uh, let me know when you guys 
We'll stream next and maybe I can do that for one of my next streams. Yeah, I'm very curious to try it. Where am I going? Okay. That's blocked off. How do I get over here? Oh, stairs. the hair hallway? Shoot. Okay. Let's go back. I'm ready to yell at some ghosts, so that should be fun. I heard they get really angry when <laughs> we curse at them and stuff. I just want to find the butterfly door before this stream ends. <laughs> don't be rude to ghosts. Jeez. They don't have a potty mouth, okay? Oh my god, I don't know where to go. Where? It's not over here, is it? No, that door's locked. to look it up. Where's the door? Damn you, short-term memory. I started right near it, didn't I? we were doing a charity maybe it's not going to be on Halloween but I think it's it's still happening I know work wanted to play oh, sorry I know October wanted to play through the Resident Evil games and I was gonna join and talk and stuff but I'm not sure when that's happening I can't believe how lost I am where is where is it Hard hallway. How do I get here? <laughs> I don't know how well I can talk about them though. I get all the names mixed up all the time. Man, I may have to look up where the door is. Let me 
didn't want to find it before. Where does this door lead? Let's go, okay, let's go through this door. This is the... Was it over here? I know it wasn't that door. It's not those doors. That's locked. That little door's locked. Those are locked. It's n not that one. Is it? No. Remember, there's some stairs by the door. So maybe it's this one. I don't remember it being a double door, though. It's not these ones, I already checked these ones. Is so not fair. I can't, I can't hide, I can't run. Hurry up, dude.
I know, because I'm freaking out that there's this ghost lunching for me. Oh boy. the door. Yay! We found it. It took me too long. <laughs> yeah, we get back here. This is to... Let's save. Where is this room? Oh, so it was this hallway. I just didn't know how to get down these stairs. Okay. She's just witnessing everybody's dreams. Yay! <laughs> we found the whoops. Found the butterfly door. Alright, I'm gonna end it here since it's eleven o'clock. But I will continue it tomorrow. Hopefully not get as hopelessly lost as I did tonight. Yeah. So thank you guys for hanging out with me. Sorry not much happened due to my getting lost but hopefully more exciting things will happen tomorrow so you guys have a great day and i will speak to you all again real soon good night